So the old dumb jog stereotype has been around as school has had sports, but as of late, Stephen F. Austin State University is not just doing everything they can to wipe out that mode of thinking. KTK's Matt Thibodeau explains. For many years, people believed athletes couldn't be scholars, but at SFA, that's not the case. Gone are the days when, when those stereotypes uh, hold true anymore. Uh, most of our student athletes are very successful in the classroom. Nearly 60% of our student athletes are 3-0 students or better. And accomplishing this was simple. All NCAA athletes are held much more accountable than regular students, and they're held to a much higher standard. We have a higher threshold of, of classes they need to pass every year to be in order to be able to play. They have to have a higher GPA in order to be able to play. So yeah, there are extra rules that are imposed on them. Players like Marlon Walls take that standard and go above and beyond with it. Walls is the first lumberjack to bring home the first team academic All-American award. I just try to separate myself in that aspect. Like, I don't want to be that stereotype where, uh, oh, you hear a football player, he's just getting his school paid for, he's just going to class just to make it through. Walls may be a standout, but he's not the only athlete doing well in the classroom. The average GPA for student athletes is actually higher than the rest of the campus, and the reason for that is simple. The mission of the university is not to be the all-conference football player. The mission of the university is to come, uh, choose a major, uh, achieve uh, academic success, and graduate. If we're not doing all of that, we've got our priorities all messed up. And as Wall so boldly put it, we only can go up from here. Matt Thibodeau, KETK News.